Hello, everybody, and welcome or welcome back to Dice Folk, the creature collecting, dice building, roguelike in. We're going to be going with the Warrior Talisman on trial level eight. Oh my. Uh, chimeras have an additional equipment slot upon recruit, and common enemies have better stats. Have even better stats. Um, you know, could be bad, could be not a big deal. It's a little ambiguous, but an extra equipment slot is a big deal for what it's worth. Uh, the thing I'm really excited about is see what is the warrior relic going to be on ally attack attack the opposing leader once what? <laughs> what that is staggeringly good okay maybe we're gonna be just fine tin bell I'm gonna take the sun tears it's just pretty much always at least a little good we're gonna avoid both of these things until we get our first chimera uh but we also have yeah the iridescent the shiny Huh? On spawn attack the opposing leader. Yeah, 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 okay. That could be bad, though. Like, if it, if it was you, we would have just lost, kind of? I mean, not necessarily, but... That... That's terrifying. Or, well, it's once per turn. Maybe it wouldn't be that big of a deal. Um... How do I handle this? We could get this smacking here. And then we have Yugo, who has the relic. You do. Do a little bit of a rotate. You attack, ally attack. Clash attack, ally attack. I think that's the way. Just get all of that jazz done. What's your deal? On attack, inflict two confusion on the target. I mean, it's annoying, but it's also kind of like... I think that's sort of just... Ooh, what I have to do? You know, we have all the shielding, so we, we can absolutely Giga Blast one person in the front. We could just eliminate them, basically, immediately. Croc of Greed, turn end if you're in the lead, get two gold, sure. Alright, first Chimera. Snail Man is so good... <laughs> Snail Man is so good, and so good with the uh, the Warrior Relic as well. We have done a full-on Snailman run. We are looking for somebody who can utilize intelligence well. Mm -hmm. When attacked once per turn, afflict three bleed to all opponents. That is already good. That is already quite good and a, a valid use for Sun Tears, for sure. Um, in the event that we don't get a lot of rotates in for them, it's... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Let's think, let's think on that. I might take it, I might not. First things first, let's go ahead and check our other Chimeras. We'll, we'll see what we're working with first. First things first, bang, 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 bang. I mean, wow. So, when an ally attacks, you will attack the opposing leader. Gotcha. All right. We are looking more for a clash here than anything. Oh, oh man, that, that all did not go well. <laughs> that did not go well. So we kind of want to do this. That counts as us technically doing an attack. Four and five. I mean, we, we don't kill. So I feel like I have to take this two damage. We're really, really going to want to go for a um, yeah, a new Chimera. Going to be pretty darn desperate for it, to be quite honest. Because this is, this is bad. We might need to use a heal already. Because these shields just eat a lot of value from us. The free rotation, that's never going to be anything. Um, I think we take this one hit here. We don't really want to rotate that way. Oh, thank you. Okay, so guard. You can just attack me here, it's fine. 
All right. Good God. All right. I'm in there. I didn't. I just don't want to have to use my tokens this early. That'd be annoying. Mausoleum, arm cannon. Sure. Arm cannon's very good. I prefer it to the other thing that you uh, often will find in the first activation shop. New guy. Spell, attack the opposing leader. Yeah. Just, just, yep. Basically. Okay. That's just a, that's just a good one. Nothing crazy about it. Just a good thing. And then we're going to go for... Yeah, I'll give you the berries. Get the stat ups across the board. We could give you another inventory slot. I don't want to give you these. Doesn't really matter that much. The activation on you is definitely interesting. The heat is interesting. I think I'm going to go for the inventory slot, though. I think it's the call. As weird as it kind of is, and we'll give you the activation. Even though it'd be kind of better on the other guy. I don't know. Get the dice smith. Because we're, we're hurting. We want to get something going. Energy Blast is nice. Charge token is nice. It's not yet, but I think maybe I do it. I think maybe I buy the, I buy the guy. Without attacking. So that's the thing. Without attacking, I feel like that is not going to be fully worth it. But I'll do it. Activate once. I'm going to get it on this one a little bit weirdly. And then a reroll. All right. And then we'll go out. We'll do another fight. And then we'll get enough money to buy that guy. All right. Gonna rotate. All right. Feels good. I like this bird. I like this bird. How many spells does it have? Six. So six turns it has that ability. That's quite good. It doesn't even need to be the one in the front. You know? How much strength do you have? You have? Did you have six? You have four. Four, huh? Hmm. I could get rid of you since you're dying, but you're the one with the six HP. I'd rather save you for last. Because if I get you, I can obviously put in the sun tears. That's already something. But it's a commitment in something that's not very synergistic with this whole setup. We can get dumber than that, so I just don't want to waste. Just don't want to waste that um, that item. Armantis uh, is nothing. <laughs> what the hell, uh, man? Okay, this is weird. She's going to give you so many freaking item slots, you're not going to know what to do with them, because I already don't know what to do with them. So why... Why did you get a strength up? Ooh, you weren't attacked. What? Huh. Alright, well, I kind of want to just eat this. Oh, 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 oh. Lunago. Duh. Very nice. More money for me. Alright. I'm super in. I'm super in. Incapacitate token. Fantastic. Hmm. 
Hmm. Hmm. Um. It will pay for itself. Surely. I I don't I can't do this yet. But that will surely pay for itself over the course of the run. Even if I just had it on the frontline guy and only the frontline guy, that would pay for itself. Armantis. Bonk, 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 bonk. I could clash from you. It's, we have the heal thing. It's kind of nice. Just an absolutely relentless assault here. All right. This faction feels like it makes more sense with the old shield thing. Passive for intelligence on rotation chance of becoming incapacitated. It's not bad at all. Um. <laughs> what could go wrong? What could go wrong? Just no escape. Sure. <laughs> Sounds good to me. Smile and wave. Aww. This is just, it's, it's very finicky. I, yeah, I don't care. I don't care about this garbage. This hoo-ha. Final check on the dice smith. We, we bought that entire stock. Okay. Alright, I'm not taking that guy. Koshmara. So yeah, the energy blast. So we don't want to use all of our dice. Always is. I... Yeah. I'm just gonna deal with it. Thank you very much. Uh, I would love to rotate this back. Thank you so much. We gotta be very careful. It's super tempting to use this last one. We do not want to do it. We do not want to use our final die. It will be a problem. Cool. Now imagine if we just have somebody who's got a good amount of strength. Traveler's backpack is a no-go on attack. Four intelligence on attack, lose a gold. That is not on par with the Jester Fools. I mean, I guess it is in the late game. Huh. Yeah, it's really, it is in the late game. I'll just take the War Diary, though. Three intelligence with no downside at all. It's kind of hard to be mad at. Immediate Chimera. Please, please. Enemy rotation attack the opposing leader no matter where you are. That's pretty good. Obviously, there's a little bit of synergy there with the man who man who make bleed, but eh. on spawn gain a max HP forever. Hmm. 
So I'm not really sure what to do with all of this intelligence yet. <laughs> not really sure if we will um, ever find a use for it. We'll see. This, this faction does not have a lot of use for it on average. On spawn, self-inflict blind. Oh, that's your shiny version. It's like, yeah, it's whatever. On hurt regen to an ally? Uh-oh. Yeah, we need to rotate first. Okay. Uh, you need to rotate first. As spooky as it may be. No, man, no. <laughs> no, I didn't mean to do it. I didn't mean to do it. I was just, cl I clicked. I clicked too fast. Oh, God. Oh, God. We got to win this turn, which uh, the good news is I think we can, and I don't think it'll be hard. Well, you didn't wait. You didn't trigger when this triggered. It's not once per turn. No. I'm not giving you an equipment slot. I'm going to be replacing you. At this point, I do want to just go for some stats, though. I have no idea what to do with all these dang equipment slots. So he didn't trigger on the rotate attack, did he? Did he? Attacks up to three times. On enter lead as well, I see. So yeah, that does not count. You are annoying. Oh, of course you got the three. Of course you got the three. Oh, my lord. See, yeah. Attacks the opposing leader. When an ally attacks, attack the opposing leader once. Wahapa. Does that not synergize? I really would have assumed it would. Strength increase? No. On activation, heal four. That's not bad. Good God, it's so much intelligence. Battle start, grant all guard to opponents? Gee, okay, I think I'll do it. I just need to find somebody who uses intelligence. <laughs> All right. Uh, I would love a shield. Holy. The strength upgrade could be really good, too, of course. So it does work, just not all the time. Okay. 
So the activation is triggered already. And this... The clash is going to be... Bit of a... Bit of a wild choice. Yep. Kind of figured. So I wanted to get another free attack on the rotate, which... I guess it's just because it happens too close in conjunction with if we go attack, boom, and then it's part of the same, like, stack, I guess? I, I suppose? Stop giving me help! Please! More strength. All right. Cool deal. I think we can handle it. We don't need to heal. Oh, boy. Yeah, I was about to say, give me an activate and this is over. <laughs> what on what after one? After one. Enemy rotate token is really good with this setup. All right. Another ch this is like a, a real chance for somebody with an intelligence that on attack once per turn if your target is an ally it deals poison damage equal to its strength to a random enemy. It's... <clears throat> it's good. It's good. It's good enough. It's just not... I don't care. <laughs> I just don't care about it. No thank you, not interested, pass. I was looking for an activate. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. And now completely fortunate. See, just like the 10 damage on that extra trigger and on every rotate, whenever anyone either... Whenever an ally attacks or the enemy ever rotates. It's just such a nasty, nasty one-two punch. That's really good. For obvious reasons. Uh-oh. <laughs> that sucks. Do I force a rotate just so I can... Like, utilize everything I just did, basically? He's got blind on him, so... Congrats on the heal. Uh, once per battle, the holder revives and strongly heals. Yes, please. A mana? Sure. I don't know how many fights I'm going through six turns, you know? And thus having value in that, but eh. I'd rather just there heal you up a little bit. No, a token? A token, maybe? An attack? I mean, an attack all. Probably only triggers one counter. Or not. Not really a counter attack. Like a combo attack? Setup attack? I don't know, man. Carab the Rapper! 
That's a good one. Give me a clash. Yeah. That went so well, it's not even funny. We need to put the hand of Midas on him. I mean, it's not that big of a deal. But I should. Some days are hard in this game, and some days are like that. Huh. Is, is it that much better to have the hand of Midas on you? Yeah, yeah, because it's also on the rotates. Don't have any debuffs. I could, I could get one soon. Arm cannon is kind of just like it plays into something I'm doing already. At this point. At this point, yeah, that's that's a good item. That's a good item, no matter what. No matter who ya. Let's move this way, since if we don't like the first one, we have the other option pretty close. Hello. On rotation, do three damage to the opposing leader. Gotcha. Oh, I, I was like, I'm going to rotate and then do the shield thing. I was just looking for the activate. There we go. Should probably have put it on the guy at this point. Could have been some good value. Have another mana that I don't need to use. You have a lot of healing already. This could be bad. Focus. It, it wasn't. If we rotate, that man is... He's just dead. The next time he uh, he shows up into the front, he's he's gone. Does it make sense to activate again if you don't know? It doesn't. It's only a one time. Oh, rip. Nine burn! Eleven burn! Uh, it's a little annoying. But we will just do this. We lose that on two bucks and, and a bit of HP, but it's fine. End turn token is incredible. I don't know if I'm ever using the charge token. Screw it. Watch us. We're, we're going to get the intelligence one, but there's not a lot of... Uh, there's not a lot of units in this faction that use intelligence. All right. All right. <laughs> all right. All right, all right, all right. So that's uh, no point for the intelligence stuff. Like, obviously we take that, though. Th this is just... Um... <laughs> this is just... Uh... It's just a hilarious kind of a thing here. Ooh! Uh... That's a bummer. sucks but they i mean they froze me i didn't or they uh, they made me sleep i didn't know what i don't know what to do there oh we have a clash as well 
it's just all bad, man. We need to get you back. Maybe I just don't care about uh, Glavictus. Or better yet. Blech. A bummer, but... Okay, I was looking for an activation. Thank you. It's 30 damage. <laughs> yeah, that's what, it's, that's what it looks like when you don't put everyone on my team asleep before I get to do anything. It's a whole different world, isn't it, buddy? I mean, it's, it's, yeah, it's worth it. At this point, just raw stat upgrades are really big. This is better. Right? Yeah. Unless... I, I don't... It's just because you got the Ring of Sloth, and I, I can't move that. That's the four. Otherwise, we... Yeah. Obviously, the order of operations on that we wish was uh, different, but that's fine. All right. Definitely a, a potentially scary endeavor here. Two damage to all opponents. That, do you die first or what? Oh, thank you. Okay, I, I thought so. And then that... Okay, that makes sense that that can't go again. can't activate again there. I mean, we could activate to heal. Right? Or do we get rid of that? Do we ever have that? Oh, man. Oh. Oh, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Deals damage equal to its own strength. On guard, deal damage to its own strength equal to the opposing leader. Very specific. Exit lead, three regen to the new leader. I don't think I'm going to really do much with that right now. Passive force strength when it exit lead. Uh, that's a really good item because if they just never enter the... If they just never enter the lead, then they never lose it. So, this is starting to become possibly the better call. Hmm. Just 16 all the time? The one activation is really nice. I mean, you'll never be able to carry more. I think maybe this is okay. It was just a five. I mean, it's just another hit. It's not that much, though. Campfires, we really uh, are going to be going for stats. the guard there well mm. 
we are going to have to take this hit here. And then this too. At least we get attacked back. Ah! <laughs> I just... Don't mess. There we go. <laughs> Love it. At the 39. You're getting real tanky, too, from just having that plus... I mean... Hard to believe that we would find something we'd rather have. I couldn't want something less. I... I'd, I'd say... Dude, how many times are we going to have to fight this squad? It is a brutal one for us in specific here. See, like, that one seems Clavictus... It seems like Clavictus should have gone. Like, it really, it triggers very generously sometimes, and then sometimes it's, it's very, okay, stop. Stop with the bitter berries. There we go. Strength upgrades are just very, very good. Very late dice smith. Uh, I'll take the rerolls. Definitely happy with that. I think we're good with the energy blast, but we're, no, we want to, yes, 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 yes. We have the free rotate. We might mess with that, but we definitely should at least fight this elite first. God, I wish I... I don't know. I don't think that um, the ant was necessarily the play. Like, I don't fully regret it or nothing. Like, the AoE there doesn't work as crazy as you would maybe want. Okay. Good money. We can activate. We can get our... Whoa! <laughs> our guard going. Rotate. Nice! That was, that was so lucky. Yes, we'll take our three, and then we'll get you back in front and you die. Great. Perfect. Beautiful. Love it. 10 out of 10. Ally KO'd strong heal? No. Alright, so now we are going to be going for this garbage. And I guess final call on items. A heal all token might be better. We could get this so that we have just like an extra one. Like if we do this, it's so that we have it for... Um, we have it for the fights before the final. No, two activation will not give us uh, 40 or whatever. I think this is worth it over something we have. Uh, I mean, over an empty, surely. This is a purify all. The purify all could be a, a day saver in like the final fight. I think we just chill. Hmm. You. Okay. Uh. I don't know on this one.
I love that those proc back to back there. That's really fun. <laughs> Not great, but whatever. We're going to be completely fine in this fight, I'd say. Yeah. Eh, thank you for the clash. Thank you for the free kill. Next. On spawn of health is not full for strength for the rest of health. Um, maybe. Instead of what? Well, we don't need gold anymore. Okay. Could just bonfire get stats now? Croc of Greed is completely irrelevant. This is not completely irrelevant. It is for health. So you're the one with the activation now. That's right. On spawn, one max HP forever. Technically, we should do one more fight and then sub this out. Because, like, that'll start grant guard to all opponents. Who cares? I mean, yeah. I mean, technically. Technically, that's going to be optimal by, like, a little bit of HP. Ooh. Interesting. Okay. Not exciting for me to see that. Don't use all dice. Whatever you ding dong do. This is, see, this is what I'm saying. The energy blast is like not even very good. I'm willing. I can't imagine we will want to use this. Yep, okay. Uh, the activation, I could do it to heal, but I feel like there's just something better to do. Ooh. Thank you. That was very kind of you to just give me that. Well, okay, it's not that kind. Maybe I take it back a bit. Okay. Barely matters on that one. This is a lot over here. Still is a lot. I mean, I'm not going to get a shield. Man, I I don't know. That may, maybe was worth... I mean, it was, we should have re-rolled earlier there. It might be worth um, trying to find... Yeah, and activate to heal 4 HP at the very least. And then... Maybe, okay, all right, fine. I was gonna say maybe we could stall a turn to get another activate. It's fine. We should probably heal and probably be smart. Oh, well, we don't even have to change it. There you go. Other stuff just doesn't matter. All right, and then I, I'm electing to go for stats. Screw it. I want to. That's what I want to do. 
We have the heal if we really need it. We have the player dicelet, which has a heal on it as well. Like, I think we've got this going. Purify one. It's good to see. The thing is, that is our, um... Hmm. I don't think we re-roll any of this. Well, we, we'll re-roll the last one. And then we'll obviously re-roll his stuff. Well, I'll, I'll take this. Purify is not really what I'm looking for, but thank you. There's play in trying to kill the tail. Sure. There's also play in just bringing you back into the lead while I have a shield before we mess something up. Looking for an activate. No activates. Where are the activates, man? Where are they? Good God. All right. I'm saving. I'm saving my attack all until then. This is so definitely a win. It's not even funny. You'd think that there would be an activate. You, you'd think there would be one, right? I don't really fully need it. I just want it. Huh. What are the odds? We have a revive. Alright, we're getting through the entire fight before we find our first one. It's official. That was tough. That was tough. That was a caveman run right there. It was... That was the most uh, warrior faction run I've ever warrior factioned. <laughs> that is for sure. Uh, okay. New Chimera can be recruited. Magna Karanos almost got uh, new items, which I'm going to guess is the final unlock. I could be wrong. Just going based off of how much stuff... Well, maybe, maybe, maybe there's one more. Eh, there might be one more, but it's also like some of these are ones that I know we've unlocked, but I just haven't um, seen. Oh, I thought this was uh, this was this one. This is a different dragonfly thing. It's a scorpion dragonfly. All right. Well, hey. Uh, really, really good relic to start with. All of your chimeras spawn with relentless. Oh, the additional enemy die is even stronger. Okay. Who knows? I can't. I can't know how scary that is until we get in. But your chimera spawning with relentless is a big deal. That is, um, the first time your Chimera would die to an attack, they don't. They stay alive at 1 HP. That's a big one. But this is... I, you know, what I'll say is, without a shadow of a doubt, it is getting harder. <laughs> like, a lot harder. Today, you wouldn't know... Because it also gave us a very stupidly strong relic, and we found, like, a dream squad to go with it. Uh, but it is getting tougher. Oh, wait, hold on. We actually, we get to know. Okay. One more Chimera. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. All right. Uh, man, I really do wish that the Chaos Talisman had um, a trial mode button. But it's also, like, it's a weird one. Because that means we, we don't get any of the... Like, I don't actually have interest in playing it anymore because it, it's not in the trial mode. Because 
And this is a compliment to the trial mode. Uh, aside from literally one, which is the common enemy spawn, like all enemies have guard, which again, I've, I've, I've said my piece on it. I don't think it's like, why, why does the check mark keep going up and down? Is it... Oh, it's the highest trial completed with that faction. Gotcha. That makes sense. Okay. I get every I get everything now. Um It's not that it's not a good thing to technically make it harder. It's just that compared to everything else, it feels weird. It's very slow paced. I it's not my favorite. If it was the last one, maybe. But every other one of them, when paired with the equivalent thing that you get. I would say is 100% a more fun way to play the game. And therefore, it's a very successful ascension mode. And therefore, it creates this weird situation where I don't even want to play this faction because it doesn't have the difficulty setting because the difficult, the higher difficulties are more fun. Which is, it's a great problem to have, but it also means please for the love of God, let me let me throw on ascension mode for this um hopefully it's like coming later or something like that or maybe if i beat trial mode then i get to do it i don't know anyway so last last that is that is gonna do it here for today thank you for watching check out the chat for rogue likes and more of a if you'd be sad to see the series go god let me know in the form of a comment down below thank you for watching thank you thank you and i will see you next time bye